Do you know when you'll be out of debt? I mean, like the exact month and year. Are you tracking your progress towards the goal of becoming debt free? If you're not, you're probably never going to make it. You're probably going to always pay those minimum payments. That's going to keep you in that cycle of debt, adding more than you're actually paying off, filling up the tub faster than it's draining out. If you're on a debt free journey and you want to actually reach your destination, you're going to want to watch this video. My name is Paris Clough and this is Financial Self-Reliance. I absolutely love helping people manage, protect, and grow their money. In this video, we're going to talk about what it really takes to become debt-free and the fastest, most efficient way for you to get there. When I started in financial services about two decades ago, there were a lot of horrible statistics that I wanted to help change. The average American household was in debt up through their eyeballs. They didn't know how to manage their money effectively. And it was just a really bad situation. In fact, most families fell apart. Divorces were at an all-time high and they're getting, and there was it's just too many fights and arguments about money and how to manage and protect it and grow it properly. And so I wanted to make sure when, when I started in the industry, I wanted to get, have a career where I could change the, the statistics. I wanted to move the needle. The biggest reason why most people were like that is because they were just never taught in schools and, and churches and universities. We just don't teach how to properly manage money. We don't teach people how to get out of debt and stay out of debt and, and manage interest rates and investments and, and different types of things that they need to have in a portfolio like insurance and other things. So most people have never been taught how to manage their money properly. And if they have, they were probably, you know, never held accountable with a financial coach. And that's one of the things that actually makes a big difference is having a financial coach, somebody that you can be accountable to. See, the traditional industry, uh, an advisor or an agent wants to just sell you a financial product. They want to sell you a stock or a mutual fund, or they want to sell you a 401k or an IRA, or they want to sell you an insurance plan or a life insurance, a term insurance, a permanent insurance. They're just there really to sell you a product. They were not really there to see how those things fit into the overall picture of your life, how each of those pieces fit like a puzzle into the overall picture of your financial goals and dreams. And the reason why I know that is because I was one of those agents for many years. I was recently talking with an old friend who actually has been in the same industry as me. He was in there actually for almost three decades, a little more than that. And he was telling me the same thing. We were lamenting about how the statistics have not yet changed. In fact, they're worse. There's more household debt. There's more confusion. There's more uh, people that are completely confused about what to do with their money, managing their money. It's not gotten better. It's actually gotten worse. And that's frustrating. It's really frustrating for me. I, I know the things that people and families can do to really change their situation. And I know I can help them do it. If they would just follow some of the things that are happening. And, and that's when I realized that most of financial planning has very little to do with math. Everybody knows that if you have $100 and you spend $110, you are going to be in debt. Everybody knows that you should spend less than the money than the amount of money that you're making so that you have extra. But why don't we do it? Why don't we make the change? Why don't we actually have the habits that serve us and get us to where we want to go? It's more than likely because we've made decisions and choices and no one told us any, gave us any feedback. No one held us accountable and we just kept doing it. And before we knew it, human nature, path of least, least resistance, we were literally up to our eyeballs in debt and now we're drowning. As a country, we're drowning. Recently, I think there was, a there was something about how the credit card debt in this country is over $1 trillion. That's absolutely ridiculous. Recently, I met with the CEO of a fintech company that I believe is really going to revolutionize the way financial services are done and the way that coaching is really administered to people who need the help. And frankly, more often than not, almost everybody that I know needs some kind of coaching, some kind of education, some kind of assistance to help make their situation even better. I'd like to share with you what I think is one of the fastest, most efficient ways for you to get control of your money, get yourself on a plan to actually get out of debt, know exactly the date you're going to be getting out of debt, but then even better than that, obtain financial independence. Know when your date is, know what month and what year you can actually obtain financial independence based on the goals that you have for your family. What would you do if you knew exactly the date you'd go get out of debt, exactly the date that you would have financial independence? Put a comment below and let me know how you'd feel knowing that you'd be totally debt free. Some of you may not even believe debt freedom is possible. And so you're, you've kind of closed off to those feelings of joy and happiness and hope. I promise you, you can obtain financial independence, you can be debt free, and you can be financially independent. It just takes the right habits, the right work ethic, and a good strong coach to get you there. But before I share that in with you, I'd like to invite you to take a quiz. It's a seven question quiz that'll help you to understand the importance of knowing that it's more about habits and behaviors than it is about math. It's more important to change the habits that got you there in the first place 
and work towards building habits that are going to serve your future and get you to where you want to end up being, not just on time, but get there as fast as possible. So let me show with you really quickly this. If you look, look in the description below, you'll come up across a link that says planning. This will tell you how well your propensity for financial planning is, whether or not you're going to be good at budgeting, whether or not you're going to be good at managing your money, whether or not you have uh, a lot of need for improvement or if you're doing just fine. So let me share with you a couple of the first two questions here. My household operates on a fairly well thought out manual budget. Strongly agree, disagree, um, strongly disagree. Or the next one, when it comes to financial planning, I typically budget time every day, every week. I have someone else manage it for me, put it off into the future. I do not do any financial planning, nor do I have someone do it for me and totally unsure. These are some great insights. And at the end of this seven question quiz, you'll have a lot more information about yourself, your habits, and maybe some things that you can work on. Once you do that, make sure that you reach out to me at hello financialselfreliance.net and let's get together and have a call about whether or not it would be a good fit for me to be a coach for you. All right, now let's talk about this new platform that I was sharing with you. It's called WiseFi. And it's awesome because if you want to be financially independent, that's you have to make wise decisions. So I, I talked to the CEO about this and he shared with me some of the reasons why he created this name. And that was that was along those same lines is that he wanted to have a real wisdom about what it takes to create financial independence. And wisdom comes from experience. And he and I both have were talking about the statistics as well, about how there's so many people out there that just don't know how to manage their money properly. And that's kept them in this horrendous cycle in this loop of debt and not obtaining any degree, a real degree of financial independence. So what is WiseFi? WiseFi is a tracking system. When you first sign up, you're gonna have the setup here is four steps. First is your accounts. So with your accounts, you're gonna want to connect with, with your bank through Played, or you can do an add manual account, and then you can add those things in manually. So you can add in your all of your bank accounts, all of your credit cards, all of your investment accounts. Then what you'll do is you'll come to the next step and you'll do your goals. And as you put in here, what is your monthly de desired income at Financial Freedom? I put $6,000 a month. You could put seven or eight or nine or more, and then your desired financial freedom age. I just want to retire on time at 65 for now. I'm just kind of messing around with the numbers. You can change this later and actually show, it'll show you how what you need to do to actually hit your goals. Your next thing is your income. I haven't put that in here yet. And then it shows your projections, which is basically what is your chances of getting out of debt and when you'll get out of debt. And it shows you to the exact day of when you'll get out of debt. Now, once you're in, once you've done all that, you have your dashboard up here, you have a plan, you have your transactions here as they come in from your bank or as you download them, you'll be able to categorize those into different areas so that you know exactly where they are when it comes to the plan you'll know if they're in housing transportation food health insurance clothing etc then you have reports here and reports is where you get the opportunity to see your assets as they grow track your net worth you'll get to see your spending categories if you're over budget under budget is a great way to keep you on track so if you feel like WiseFi would be a good fit for you and you would like to have the opportunity to be able to have a software that tracks your expenses, tracks your and helps you budgeting. Not only does it track what you've spent, but it also gives you a guideline of what you ought to be spending in each of these categories so that you can really budget properly going forward. One of the biggest problems that I find is most people don't know what they spent money on. They spent $20 here, $30 there, $10 here. Before you know it, that can add up to hundreds and hundreds of dollars. Once you track and categorize all of your expenditures and from every bank account and every credit card account, you're going to realize, oh my gosh, I'm nickel and diming myself to death. I'm, I'm buying things today that are robbing my future potential debt freedom and financial freedom. So I want to be able to make some changes today. And that's what this kind of software does. It makes you aware of what's going on in your financial life so that you can be able to make changes. Awareness brings change. And this is the fastest, most efficient way to do it. Not only that, but it's absolutely inspiring to know that if I do this, then I will be out of debt even sooner. Or if I do this, maybe I won't be out of debt sooner. I'll be out of debt later. So you can actually put scenarios in there and say, look, if I, do, if I bought this, how much would that affect my debt freedom date? And you would know. So I was talking with a friend earlier today and she's pregnant. She's doing about two months and she says that being pregnant is horrible. Now I've, I'm a man, I'm not, I've never been pregnant, but I've, I have have five kids and I've been there all along the way with my wife. And I know that it's a really tough thing for, to be pregnant for a woman. And she said that, um, she's just really hoping that when she holds the baby for the first time, that her perspective will change and that it will all be worth it. And so I want to share with you that sometimes going through transactions and going through and tracking your income, tracking your expenses, 
tracking every little thing that happens that you do, it's burdensome, it's tiresome, it's, it's actually can be quite frustrating. But once you obtain debt freedom, once you become financially independent, once you start to have a positive net worth, once you see your assets grow, it's all worth it. I highly recommend that you get a coach, get an accountability partner, get somebody that you can talk to on a regular basis to help you get out of debt as soon as possible. Set a goal, make a plan, and track your progress along that plan. If you want help to do that, click the link in the description below, get your WiseFi account set up, and then send me a message at hello at financialselfreliance.net, and let's see if we can get together and make sure that you have a good, strong coach that will keep you accountable and help you get where you need to go and have you obtain debt freedom and financial freedom. If you missed the last video I produced, go ahead and find it here. Subscribe to the channel up here and check out this video up here, the YouTube things you might like. Until the next one, stay financially self-reliant.